Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander-in-Chief of the Defense Forces, the Honorable Speakers of the two Houses, Cabinet Secretaries present, and all stakeholders, good afternoon. Your Excellency, I didn't think I needed to say anything because you speak on our behalf, but let me take this opportunity because I'm here to salute the members of the National Assembly and the Senate for the expeditious manner in which they had these bills that you have today assented into law. Your Excellency, we continue to applaud the two Houses of Parliament for the support they are giving to your administration's legislative agenda. Your Excellency, what now you are sent means is that we who work under you have everything to do to implement these laws in turning around healthcare architecture for the benefit of the people of Kenya. But I would like also to take this opportunity to say much as Parliament has worked very hard, the CS of Health and her team have worked very hard. Your Excellency, your personal leadership in this matter has been very momentous. For the last one year, you have chaired countless meetings that gave birth to these bills that you have today assented into law. You have been very keen and categorical that a healthy nation gives way to a prosperous nation. So the journey that we have started today with the assenting of the bills will turn around the healthcare architecture for the benefit of the people of Kenya. And Your Excellency, I want to confirm that I have been around the country and since you were launched of the community health promoters with 100,000 kids. The impact of that intervention, Your Excellency, is already being felt on the ground. And the focus on preventive medicine as opposed to creative medicine will ultimately save this country on the health bill. There is data and research has shown that the cost of curing a disease is nine times the cost of preventing one. So, therefore, Your Excellency, this intervention in another four or five years will also bring down the cost of the health bill. Let me also take this opportunity to thank the county governors and their county governments for the way they continue to work closely with the national government, health being a devolved function, and I have no doubt in my mind that this collaboration will continue so that these laws can have an impact for the people of Kenya.